that was a very short piece written actually by one of uh, Johann Sebastian Bach's sons, uh, Carl Philipp Emanuel. We decided to play this because Bach uh, calls for some sort of intrada to be played at the end of this particular cantata, but the music uh, specifically is not indicated. We don't know what was played, so we really had to seek out some sort of material that might pass. Firstly, it has to be in D major. Nearly all trumpet music, fortunately, is in D major. We also had to choose a piece that might have some sort of municipal background. There's much military trumpet music from the time. Uh, most of these Aufzüge were composed for three or four trumpets and drums, and were usually played by court trumpet players from the time. Um, trumpet players in Leipzig were um, not part of the military establishment. They were employed by the town, the Stadtpfeifer. Um, we don't, didn't have anything suitable uh, from the time, so this seemed to be a rather appropriate piece to play. The expression Bach Trompeter has grown up to describe something uh, which is something that Bach would never have heard. The natural trumpet as it stands is basically just uh, a little short of eight feet of tubing. Um, we talk about instruments as being lengths of feet like uh, organ stops. The trumpet is an eight foot instrument, but unusually we play it in the two foot and one, one foot registers. It has no moving parts. It's just a, a piece of cylindrical tube with, with a bell on the end. This, um, the trichter, which serves to modify and amplify the sound. But all three trumpets that we're playing are, are basically the same, the same proportions, the same lengths, and it was really the standard trumpet that existed all over Europe by this time. Mm -hmm. 